Hello there! I have updated my portfolio recently and in this video I want to share with you the process and uh, also share was it worth it and uh, what was the results of updating my portfolio. Let's get started! So why did I decide to update my portfolio at the first place? Well, first of all, I have designed it when I was just a student in the university using just Wix, which is a site builder. I did not know how to code properly. So I've made pretty simple portfolio website where I collected all my design projects. And to be honest with you, it worked pretty well. All my jobs that I have previously, I got with this portfolio website. Super simple, just a white blank page and uh, a picture and uh, some description of my projects and the inside page where I describe in details my projects. So why did I decide to update it? Well, I've learned how to code and uh, Suddenly, so many opportunities opened for me and uh, I wasn't happy about my website, but previously it would take uh, pretty much time for me to design something that I truly want. And uh, now when I started to code, I knew how to do this uh, much faster than using some ready tool that they say uh, save your time, but it's not actually, it's just for people who, like me, uh, didn't know how to code. And uh, so, yeah, I, um, I had the opportunity to design the portfolio that I wanted. Uh, so, first of all, it was just the internal willing to do something that would express myself better. Uh, because the, my portfolio website is still pretty simple. It's still just a collection of my projects. Um, just a picture and the description and uh, some graphic elements. It's just now it feels much nicer and I feel that now it expresses myself um, much better. And so of course the second reason is that I started to look for a job recently. I am moving from Italy, this uh, beautiful Italy with the mountains, and I'm moving to Netherlands and uh, I want to find the opportunities there. So I started to look for a job. And uh, as long as I know that uh, I can do better with my portfolio, I've decided to update it. But actually, I've started to look for a job with my previous portfolio, which was pretty simple on Wix. And then in the process, I have updated it. So I can tell you if this update was worth it and uh, if I got more response with my new portfolio. So let's first see how it looks now. As I've told you, it's still pretty simple, but I've made a nice video using After Effects and Trap Code, and uh, I've just made it more interactive. So now I have an interactive menu, and I have a nice little interaction when you hover on links, and also it just looks better. So yeah, I did it on React using Next.js and React, and I was also using Tailwind. I love it. It allows me to design something that I want pretty simple and fast, unlike styled components. So styled component is the technique that uh, front-end developers used uh, before Tailwind. Actually, they are using it also now, but it makes things so much more complex than when you're using Tailwind because in Tailwind, you can just describe CSS uh, in the same page, in the same element, which makes it so much faster to build and uh, yeah, it didn't took me a long time to make. So this is how my new portfolio website looks like and now I'm going to tell you was it worth it and uh, did I get more replies after updating my portfolio? Well, yes, yes, I did get more replies. Uh, which I wasn't sure I will get more replies because the projects are the same actually, but it just the look that is different and uh, actually even the structure is the same. It's just the uh, graphic representation and I consider myself a product designer, a UX designer who does uh, a lot of user research and uh, I think that my main value not in the graphic component, but of course I do also this, but in the 
research and uh, the ability to find the right design solution. And I am usually applying for the vacancies that uh, seek such designers like me. So I wasn't expecting that updating the graphic part of my portfolio will result in better conversion. But it did. Well, one more evidence that the graphic part is extremely important for the designers. And that's actually why I have designed first UI course in uh, the series of courses that I'm going to make in uh, UX UI design and also I'm going to make the behavioral course and the course on accessible design. But the first thing that I've put online was UI design because it's super important for designers to get it right before moving to the next part and uh, learning how to actually do the design research and uh, how to actually follow the whole design process. The first thing that you have to do is um, get this first thing right especially for beginner designers who doesn't have much experience or don't have experience at all. It's super important to have a nice looking portfolio. As you could see, even for me, the person who is not applying for um, vacancies connected to UI design specifically, even for me, it resulted in better conversion. So I think for beginner designers, it's even more important. And um, yeah, also I advise you to put more attention to the look of your portfolio and spend some time just um, figuring things out and uh, making it pretty. Yeah, I hope this was helpful and uh, maybe inspiring. I don't know, but anyway, uh, see you next time. Bye. <sighs>